good morning my dear students today i am going to take the next topic under the unit biomolecules i am dr r gunasegaran professor of chemistry who is taking class for you as we have discussed let me explain what is biomolecules molecules that are present in biological systems are called biomolecules we have discussed in the last topic also important biomolecules are carbohydrates amino acid peptide polypeptides and proteins enzymes vitamins and nucleic acids so last class i have discussed under the carbohydrate glucose i have discussed today i am going to discuss fructose sucrose and polysaccharide so first let me discuss the structure of fructose when you study the structure of fructose including reaction also it is coming under this then i will compare the glucose and fructose and differentiation of glucose and fructose i will discuss first let me discuss the structure of fructose number 1 elemental analysis and molecular weight determination show that the molecular formula of fructose is c6h12o6 so we know from the the molecular weight determination my mass spectrum or from physical prop the methods we can determine the molecular mass number 2 fructose on reduction with corn hi in presence of red phosphorus produces nxa so because nxa is produced from glucose that shows glucose is a linear structure please follow containing six carbon atom so this indicates there are six carbon atoms in the fructose molecule as unbranched chain linear chain the third important point further fructose undergoes addition reaction with one mole of scn to form cyanohydrin fructose cyanohydrin and condensation reaction with one mole of hydroxyl amine fructose oxide and phenyl hydrazine corresponding phenyl hydrazone of fructose all these reaction indicates that the presence of a carbonyl group is there carbonyl group means may be a aldehyde or a keto group but not both so fructose may contain a either aldehyde group or keto group so that we are going to see now the fourth one fructose readily dissolve in waters to give a neutral solution this indicate fructose molecule does not contain a carboxyl group can you follow because carboxyl group also containing carbonyl group carbonyl group that's why we are eliminating that from the carbonyl so only aldehyde or ketone is present kindly follow and the fifth one fructose reacts with acetic acid in presence of pentene to form penta acetate normally when this is the reaction normally used to convert any alcohol into corresponding acetate please follow corresponding acetate so whenever acetate is added the addition of ch2 group will be added there during acetation one oh group so now kindly follow the co ch2 that is added so in that the total molecular mass 42 will be added that is two two carbon atom Plus twelve, plus twelve, twenty-four, plus sixteen, forty-two hydrogen, forty-two. 
So the molecular mass, if one OH group is there, molecular mass will increase by 42. So 2 means corresponding to multiply by 2, like that. So what will happen now? So this, when you acetylate this fructose with acetic anhydride in presence of pyridine to form pentaacetate, how we have identified pentaacetate? So before acetylation, we are taking molecular mass, and that is 180. After acetylation, we have observed molecular mass. It is increased by the correspondingly uh, 5 into 42. That is increased. So this indicate the presence of five hydroxyl groups. Since fructose exists as a stable compound, it indicates that five OH group should be attached to five different carbon atoms. So we know that in the organic compound, if same carbon atom having two OH group in the same carbon atom, kindly follow, then it is not stable, it will easily eliminate water molecule. So that's why this clearly, because it's a stability, it indicates clearly there are five OH groups, but in five different carbon atoms. Please follow. Number six, kindly follow. This is the most important. Fructose does not react with mild oxidizing agents such as bromine water. We have seen already under the glucose, glucose undergoes oxidation to produce gluconic acid with bromine water. Indicating that it's an aldehyde group is under oxidizing to corresponding acid. Whereas, this fructose does not react with mild oxidizing agents, such as bromine water, they indicate there may be aldehyde group may not be present. But with the concentrated nitric acid, it gives a mixture of glycolic acid and tartaric acid. Please follow, this is the structure. Acids containing lesser number of carbon atoms. So this is glycolic acid. Glycol, we know the formula. This is the glycol. So, so one of the carbon atoms getting oxidized, glycolic acid. Just see the other side. The tartaric acid is produced. So, totally six carbon atoms coming. So, this is very clearly, it's a clear evidence that, kindly follow now, let me give you the example. So, kindly follow, on oxidation with concentrated nitric acid, glucose gives the correspondingly glucaric acid or sacric acid, whereas in this, the, the, in, in this case, we are getting glycolic acid and Tartaric acid. So what is happening because of this? So let me conclude now. So formation of glycolic acid and tartaric acid shows that there is a keto group in fructose. Kindly follow. So where is the CO group present? Is the two position, three position or four position? That can be fixed by this reaction. When fructose is treated with the SCN, the corresponding cyanohydrin is formed. It forms an additional product which upon hydrolysis and the subsequent reduction with the HI and red path plus gives 2-methyl extanoic acid. Kindly follow. 2-methyl extanoic acid. This is indicates that Kindly follow, the keto group is adjacent to one of the terminal carbon atoms. The keto group adjacent to one of the terminal carbon atoms. Either at the, from the top second carbon atom or from the bottom second carbon atom. Very, very clear idea. Now, let me come for the final structure. When fructose is treated with sodium amalgam and water, it goes reduction to give you a mixture of sorbitol and mannitol. Please follow. So this is the sorbitol, this is mannitol. The structures are known very clearly. These two structures. So this further confirm that keto group is adjacent to one of the terminal carbon atom. One of the terminal carbon atom. Kindly follow. So...
This is the very interesting information. So on reduction, it is giving this sorbitol, kindly follow, and mannitol. Hence, from the above discussions and from the configuration of glycolic acid and tartaric acid, the open chain structure of fructose can be represented as, this is the structure, kindly follow. This is the open chain structure of fructose, CH2OH, CO, CHOH, 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 CH2OH. I am writing in the Fisher projection. Please follow. But actually, normally it is not present in the open chain form. Let me give for proof for that work. Fructose does not answer for carbonyl group. For carbonyl group, we have a number of uh, tests for that one. So that is not giving answer for CO group. And after oscillation, that is pentaacetate, does not react with the hydroxylamine. This shows that there is no free keto group. No free keto group. Hence, the more suitable structure for fructose may be a cyclic structure as follows. Cyclic structure as follows. There are two possibilities. CH2O is right side, CH2O left side. So, to have clear idea, so I can give this one. That means, kindly follow. Alternatively, fructose is levorotatory, that is minus. We know when you measure polar with the polarimeter, so this shows levorotatory, rotating the light, the plane polar is light, left anticlockwise. So, texorotatory, that is the glucose is texorotatory. A more suitable two cyclic structures of fructose can be represented as follows. Please follow. This is the very, very important for you. So, this is called alpha D fructopyranose. This is called beta D fructopyranose. So, in this cyclic form, it is there. So, let me take first one, beta D fructopyranose. So, this is the pyranose ring, kindly follow. Sometimes even fructose present in the furanose form, five-membered ring, please follow. If it is five-membered ring, furanose, six-membered ring, pyranose, kindly follow. So, here... This is carbon, the, the kindly follow, this is the, uh, in the cyclic, you can think of, this is, let me say, oh, this is, this is one carbon atom, this is two, three, four, five, and six carbon atom. Kindly follow this one. So, the interesting information here, in the second carbon atom, just see here, in the cyclic, it, you can assume if it is 1, 2, 3, auto, you can put. So, here in this carbon, please, for OH is above, it is beta. If it is OH is below, it is alpha. This is the most interesting information. So, alpha D fructose and beta D fructose are called anomers. Please remember, anomers. The same structure, kindly follow, we can also write in the form of chair form, more stable chair form. What way? This way we can write. Kindly follow. So here, we, we, we can write like this. One, two, three. This, this way also we can write. Please follow. Normally, when you go for higher level, you will be studying only in the chair form. So, your level, even this, this is enough. So, what you must idea is, this is this, only in cyclic form it is present. This linkage is called hemiacetal linkage. Hemiacetal linkage. So when you put it into water, any solvent, immediately it break and come to, come to the open chain structure of the fructose, this structure.
immediately it'll come to this structure so it will easily breakable please follow so so this is regarding for structure of fructose now let me compare the reactions of glucose and fructose and can't and again differentiate for glucose and fructose a few important reaction normally question can be asked the first one reactions glucose and fructose first one molecular formula the comparison this is comparison means similarity let me say comparison similarity please follow similarity 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 same molecular formula glucose and fructose having same molecular formula c6h12o6 number 2 on reduction with hi and red phosphorus both produces nxn nxa so same reaction and third one both glucose and fructose undergoes additional reaction with scn glucose form glucose anhydrin fructose form fructose anhydrin indicating corresponding carbonyl group and also undergoes condensation reaction with hydroxyl amine and phenyl hydroxyl so with hydroxyl amine it glucose form glucose the oxygens of glucose fructose form oxygens of fructose same way phenyl hydroxyl forms the correspondingly hydrozone the glucose hydrozone of glucose so there is a special name there it is called the the ozozone please follow ozozone so with phenyl hydrogen hydrochloride both glucose and fructose forms ozozone that means first and second carbon atom undergoes condensation with phenyl hydrogen hydrochloride it is forming ozozone so same so the both glucose and fructose answer one the produce same ozozone please follow coming for the the further comparison again the similarities five felling test so felling test you know already felling say felling b copper sulfate and sodium potassium tartrate mixture in sodium hydroxide you take one is one ratio to that add uh, some uh, the 0.5 grams of glucose as well as fructose in two different test tubes and put it in a water bath heat for one hour both produces red precipitate that means it is answering positive same way talens test silver mirror both glucose and fructose form silver mirror polyhydroxy compound it produce then action of sodium hydroxide this is the most important reaction please remember normally your book will not be containing this when we treat with action of sodium hydroxide what is happening glucose if you take and you treat with sodium hydroxide it it to produces fructose and mannose if you takes fructose and you treat with sodium hydroxide it produce glucose and mannose this is a rearrangement take place the rearrangement is called lobry de brun von ekinston rearrangement takes place so this is the similarity for both glucose and fructose kindly follow the final i told you here action of phenyl hydrogen that is ozozone we have already discussed one molecule hydrozone two molecule ozozone please follow so so let me point out that uh, what is the low breed the brun kinston uh, rearrangement suppose let me take c double bond o h and second carbon atom it is c o h this is the glucose all the remaining carbon atom you can uh, configuration you can refer the glucose structure so when we treated with sodium hydroxide what is happening so 
please follow this is converted into two form one is it is converted into fructose ch2oh co and this another is it is converted into h and coh this side and h please follow this is fructose this is mannose so that means this is undergoing rearrangement please follow this is undergoing rearrangement let me show you just see how it is the this um, fructose is forming just see here this is undergoing like this here it is undergoing regglings so this h will go to convert into chooh correspondingly ch2oh so what will happen now in the in between it is forming a enolic form what is the form now kindly follow this is the first forming a double bond c h and this is actually kindly follow that is uh, sorry wait a minute o minus and correspondingly double bond o kindly follow wait a minute let me explain this just please c double bond o h c o h that is glucose h and this is the carbon kindly follow so what will happen now correspondingly so <coughs> in all it is forming i can told you this way that is going out c o h h double bond c o h and this is forming so after that this is an unstable compound what will happen now so this is coming in this form kindly follow what will happen now c h h o h and correspondingly c double bond o fructose is forming this is the rearrangement please follow this is uh, enol intermediate double bond o h and through which this is undergoing rearrangement so this is kindly follow fructose then how mannose is forming kindly follow the mannose is again i can write now c double bond o h and c o h h h again so this is the two carbon atom only so i am what is happening now as usual the intermediate is forming so c double o h h and c o h and double bond and this is the enolic form so what will happen this enol so first case it is converted into fructose i shown i have already shown you now in this case what is happening now so this h coming out and this is now coming out automatically so when it is converted into this form this carbon carbon single bond rotates now structure taking like this kindly follow double bond o h and the, the, the h will come here o h will come this side so this is the mannose please follow so this rearrangement we are calling it as lobri the brayun van ekinstein rearrangement please follow lobri the brayun van ekinstein rearrangement take place so if you take glucose fructose and mannose if you take fructose glucose and mannose very very interesting information normally this will be asked kindly follow the next one so that is the uh, i can go difference between glucose and fructose this is the most important kindly follow specific rotation glucose is texto rotatory fructose is levo rotatory and the values is need not remember anyhow i tell you the, the 
the alpha d glucose one value one one three the beta d glucose nearly it is some uh, lower value whereas fructose is negative value so what you can say glucose is dextrotriterary fructose is levorotatory different then action of bromine water glucose undergoes oxidation to produce gluconic acid we know already aldehyde group converted into acid whereas fructose no reaction takes place because keto group cannot be oxidized by weak oxidizing agent bromine water when you go for action of con sulfuric acid saccharic acid is produced that is both the terminal carbon atom undergo oxidation we have seen already structure of saccharic acid under glucose as well as and the we have seen already saccharic acid whereas in the fructose we are getting mixture of glycolic acid and tartaric acid so easily we can differentiate glucose and fructose and final reduction sorbitol and mannitol glucose and fructose produces sorbitol and mannitol kindly follow this is the very interesting information the idea here it is the second the, the in the second carbon atom kindly follow because it is fructose is having second carbon atom co first carbon atom only cho so in cho the aldehyde groups undergoing the giving corresponding alcohol so that's that is giving a sorbitol please follow whereas the uh, the keto co group there are two possibility right side oh the left side oh so two possibility right side means sorbitol left side means mannitol please follow this is the important differences between glucose and fructose okay now let me go for sucrose a disaccharide sucrose c12h22o11 is a molecular formula is the commonest sugar known the most important sources are canned sugar and sugar beets it is a colorless odorless crystalline compound it is soluble in water it is kindly follow texorotatory it is a non reducing sugar please follow all glucose fructose everything reducing sugar the the most important sucrose is a non reducing sugar reason i will give later it does not reduce tolerance and felling reagent another most important sucrose on heating slowly carefully melts and when allowed to cool it solidifies to pale yellow glassy mass called barley sugar when heated to 200 degrees centigrade it loses water to form brown amorphous powder called caramel sucrose on hydrolysis gives equimolar mixture of d glucose and d fructose kindly follow these monosaccharides formed glucose and fructose are held together by a glycosidic linkage between c1 of alpha d glucose and c2 of beta d fructose please memorize question will be asked in the disaccharide that is sucrose what is there there is a glucose that is a fructose glucose in the form of pyranose form fructose in the form of furanose form five membered ring actually so here between c1 of alpha d glucose and beta c2 of beta d fructose undergo uh, the uh, connection kindly follow let me discuss the structure of sucrose Elemental analysis and molecular weight determination shows that molecular formula of sucrose is C twenty two H two C twelve H twenty two O eleven. That means two sugar molecule. If you add and eliminate water, you will get this formula. Then number two, sucrose reacts with acetic anhydride in presence of pyridine to form octa acetate. This reaction indicates that presence of eight hydroxyl groups. Shows clearly. Eight hydroxyl groups. Three. Since sucrose exists as a stable compound, it indicates that all the eight hydroxyl groups should be attached to eight different carbon atom. Number four. 
hydrolysis of sucrose with the dilute acid yield an equal mixture of alpha d glucose and beta d fructose this indicate that sucrose is a molecule is made up of one unit of each monosaccharide alpha d glucose and the beta d fructose please follow sucrose does not reduce tolerance reagent to metallic silver metallic metallic silver and filling solution to red cuprous oxide cu2o it does not form ozone so all these reactions clearly indicate that this reaction further confirm that glucose and fructose are joined through c1 of glucose pyranose form and c2 in fructose furanose form because only 1 and 2 it is joined so this sucrose will not answer for this test so the, this is one to linkage please follow so any disaccharide having one to linkage will not answer for all these test if it is one four linkage or oh, that is one five one six like that it is possible so one to linkage means that uh, the all the get for the keto group is linked here so they cannot break answer for that one the next is this is six hence from the above discussion the structure of sucrose can be represented as kindly follow this is the structure of glucose see here this is alpha d glucose please follow alpha means oh is below the ring i told you all do you how to remember my dear student please follow i give you the logic here this is the six member ring pyranose form this is one carbon atom you put simply the line so how to fill up for the glucose the in the, the alpha and beta glucose so leave the one carbon so let me write first you remember beta d glucose please follow how to remember this beta d glucose kindly follow so right oh above this is carbon 1 this is carbon 2 carbon 3 carbon 4 carbon 5 and ch2 oh above it is 6 so oh above oh is below so hydrogen here hydrogen here again oh above alternatively see here i am giving a short road and again below h here and again above here is h this is beta d fructose so if you able to remember beta d fructose you can easily write the alpha alpha means this oh come down so see here here is oh is below it is alpha d glucose this is beta d so what is mannose mean in the second carbon atom oh will be above it is mannose please follow so that is kindly follow this is another important information i am giving beta d glucose and beta d mannose they are called epimers epimer means the difference in second carbon atom configuration configuration in second car if the configuration difference in first carbon atom it is called anomer if it is second carbon atom it is called epimer question can be asked that is mannose is an example kindly follow this is fructose in the form of five, five member ring furanose form so here oh is above that is beta ch oh below and again oh below oh kindly follow alternately ch to oh 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 again oh ch to oh so if you remember this one this method again because bh oh is not there worry, worry about the don't worry about that beta so just to take ch to oh first below so ch to oh below this is above below above very easily you memorize the the writing structure of sucrose so this form you can also write in the form of the uh, uh, what you can call it as chair form so that i will not represent so i will go for 
the next other important disaccharides additional to sucrose we have three uh, important disaccharides and linkages is the most important one is lactose it is normally present in the milk so it is having beta galactose and beta glucose one four linkages kindly follow what is one four linkages kindly follow this so this is both beta this is beta d glucose so 1 2 3 4 kindly follow oh it's above here below above and here it is below so what will happen now in this case there is a galactose here a sugar called galactose so it is connected here in the galactose one carbon atom is connected this is the fourth carbon atom fourth carbon atom of glucose and galactose first carbon atom connected this is called one four linkage so lactose contains beta d galactose and beta d glucose in the form of one four linkage please follow maltose the again disaccharide alpha d glucose and alpha d glucose one four linkage same way both side glucose but alpha linkage then third is cellobios beta d glucose beta d glucose one four linkage so kindly remember this the lactose you must remember because it is galactose is involved along with glucose the maltose alpha d glucose both cases cellobios or beta d glucose please follow so i am giving the the actual structure here this is the galactose the, the glucose beta d glucose the fourth carbon atom connected here the first carbon atom this is the galactose kindly follow so what is the kindly difference the difference is here only this is above below above below so in this fourth carbon atom the configuration changed that is galactose so normally in the fourth carbon atom oh it is below glucose oh it is above it is galactose please follow so this is lactose the next one the maltose this is alpha d glucose this is alpha d glucose kindly follow so this is the this is the first carbon atom this is the fourth carbon atom connected that is called maltose disaccharide coming for cellobios from that is polysaccharide is cell, cell, cellulose from that coming yeah, this is the disaccharide cellobios both side it is beta d glucose connected again one this is four one four linkage please follow this is the way we have to represent kindly follow so actually don't think there is a ch2 group please follow so better uh, if you want you can connect directly this is o this is also o kindly follow this is for convenient i am writing that so you have to assume that it is connected through o kindly follow there is no ch2 group here this way please follow because oh oh is the uh, water is getting eliminated now let me come for the polysaccharides polysaccharides are polymers of monosaccharides the most important polysaccharides are starch and cellulose starch normally present in rice cellulose in trees they have general formula c6h10o5 n n n number n means any number high molecular mass n equal to higher number starch is the main storage of polysaccharide of plants it is a white amorphous substance with no taste or smell starch is present in wheat corn barley rice potato nuts etc starch is a mixer of two polysaccharides please follow this is most important starch is a mixer of two polysaccharide 
ஒன் இஸ் அமைலோஸ் அனதர் இஸ் அமைலோ பெக்டேத் இட் அண்டர் கோஸ் சைடாலிஸ் டு ப்ரொடியூஸ் அமைலோஸ் அண்ட் அமைலோ பெக்டேத் வாட் இஸ் அமைலோஸ் அமைலோஸ் இஸ் அ ஸ்ட்ரெயிட் லைன் பாலிசாக்கரைட் வித் ஆல்பா டி குளுக்கோஸ் யூனிட்ஸ் ஹெல்டு பை சி ஒன் சி ஃபோர் கிளைக்கோஜ் டி லிங்கேஜ் வேரஸ் அமைலோ பெக்டீன் இஸ் அ பிரான்ச் ரிச்சின் பிரான்ச் ரிச்சின் பாலிசாக்கரைட் வித் சேம் ஒன் ஃபோர் ஆல்கால் ஆல்பா டி லிங்கேஜ் ப்ளீஸ் ஃபாலோ so what is the main difference amylose is a no the without any branch linear polymer of alpha d1 for linkage amylopectin is a branch the alpha linkage branch means automatically 1 6 will be connected kindly follow also connected additional to 1 4 1 6 also will be connected now the starch solution gives a blue color with a drop of iodine please follow the starch solution gives a blue color with the drop of iodine the blue color is due to the formation of a inclusion complex between iodine and amylose fraction of starch so amylose this suppose let us say like this is a linear chain kindly going so it is in between there is iodine will be the occupied so it is giving a color of blue color please follow now when heated to temperature of 200 250 degree it changes into textrin polysaccharide changes into stextrin when boiled with the dilute acid starch ultimately yields glucose via maltose please follow with the enzyme diastase it yields maltose again so this is the starch so when you heat at at the temperature again text in same molecular formula it is represented but when you further heated it is giving maltose but again when you treat with the enzyme diastase you are getting again maltose maltose again we have seen already a disaccharide that is galactose and glucose one for linkage tell you follow the, this one cellulose is found in all, uh, sorry maltose it is alpha d glucose sorry alpha d 14 glucose linkages cellulose is found in all plants and so is the most abundant of all carbohydrates it is the material used to form cell walls and other structural features it is insoluble in water and all organic solvents Boil, that is when boiled with dilute sulfuric acid it is completely hydrolyzed into glucose that's why the cellulose is giving completely hydrolyzed into glucose so come to the conclusion thank you very much my dear students who are listening my uh, lecture so if you are a begin first time you are seeing the uh, the youtube channel my uh, channel neat chemistry by dr r gunasagaran so kindly i request you kindly click like and sub kindly click subscribe button and share it to your friends for this channel i want to give one important information normally i observed the students of the high school students higher secondary students are finding difficulty chemis- in chemistry physics and maths rather than botany zoology so i want to to help the students of india poor students of india specifically i so as a chemist i want to start a channel giving complete information regarding starting from 8th standard to 12th standard all the fundamental every idea i am giving here so that if you follow sincerely my this channel any students uh, uh, seeing this channel and uh, we are going to i am going to discuss also in future after finishing this chapters question discussion also i am going to discuss what is the question discussions that is i am selected five important national level question papers that is neat i will take 10 question from neat so only f- so for the last 6 year neat exam was there then 10 question from aims 
AIMS, All India Institute of Medical Science, then Medical College, then three IIT, four the AIPMT, and five M S A T A N D R A. So fifty questions in each unit. I am going to discuss all the questions are previous question paper. So my dear student, if you follow my channel. I can give you guarantee you will get hundred out of hundred marks in chemistry, not only in school chemistry exam, but also in the board exam, but also in the neat chemistry when you write entrance, you will get one eighty out of one eighty. So that will help you to become a doctor. Okay, for the students, other students who are waiting for neat common entrance examination, uh, the. Uh, coming for this academic year, conducted by Government of India. So students studying plus one, plus two, and plus two completed students who are waiting for. I am having a good news to you. We are running a coaching center, Vetri Coaching Center in Pondicherry for the last twenty twenty one years since nineteen ninety nine, and we have our own website Vetri Doctors. So what I want to through this, I want to give informations. We have a lot of achievement we had from the, for the last twenty years so since from the beginning. So if you go to our home page of Vitri Doctors, you can see everything, all the proof in photograph, year by year list, and all the overall uh, every year first track. I am giving the list, photograph, evidences. So. The first evidence I want to point out, most important, in 2003, one of our students, our Sinmatha Raghavan, came All India First Track in Jipmer Entrance Examination. He came first out of five to six lakhs people. He came first. At that time, neat common entrance examination was not there. Jipmer was conducting separately. This is the first achievement. The second is even in 2003 we achieved kindly listen. The second achievement is every year 10 to 20 students of our coaching through our coaching center are entering into Jipmer Medical College from Pondicherry, and 150 to 200 students are joining in other medical college through government quota by merit. And a few students are joining IIT, and hundreds of students are joining engineering colleges. This is the second most important, the achievement of ours. Please follow everything is proof if you go for the home page. Now let me come for the students who are going to attend the NEET entrance examination. I am having a good news for you. So to score 600 to 700 marks, you need to attend examination to become a doctor. So, if you join with us, with your daughters, let me explain about the features of with your daughters. The first feature is it is having two hundred video lesson. Number two, two hundred unit test. Please follow. Two hundred video lessons were taken by the professors with uh, doctorate degree, and the teaching experience of twenty to thirty years in. IIT and medical coaching. Also, they are teaching for B.Sc., M.Sc., M.Phil, and Ph.D. So they will give very clear idea, and that video will be like your classroom. Easily you can view and understand carefully. So all the when you are will uh, viewing the lesson, kindly follow. It is the full of notes. Abstracts will be given. Notes. So if you want to take notes, just touch the video and take the notes. And again, touch it will run. It's just like our YouTube. Please follow. It's just like our YouTube. So that is the most advantage. The second most important feature of need data, with the data is that is two that is two hundred unit test. Each test is having forty five questions. According as per the need entrance examination, Government of Government of India. So here. I have framed all the questions from 20 years of IIT, AIMS, AIPMT, AFMC, MC Tandara, Delhi, Karnataka, Tamil Nadu, Pondicherry, Kerala. All these question papers are 
it is included in the 200 unit test so no single question or we have not the ready time only the previous question papers are there if you want you verify can you follow so what is the advantage is for any student attending neat entrance examination they can observe after attending with the daughters they can observe nearly 75 to 80 questions will be repeated from the with your daughters the data bank bank a question bank this is observed for the last 6 years we have observed any student if you want to verify any any student who joined already in with your daughters you verify take any question paper of for the last 6 year question paper and verify each unit and then just take the question paper you can and count the number automatically 75 80 question will be there this is very very interesting information now i do, i want to give information how to attend the test unit test in with your daughters here this conducting of a test in with your daughters is entirely different from other online leading coaching center this is very very important features let me explain then you can understand so there if you go for test if you click test there is a menu called attempt click attempt a window will open a window will open in the window you, you can read there are uh, the sentences this unit contained 45 questions it carries the the duration 45 minutes each question carries four marks for correct answer four marks awarded for wrong answer minus one awarded are you ready it will ask question yes or no if yes you click okay then before that keep ready your rough notebook and pen click okay immediately window will open another window so in the window what you can see question 1 you can see option a option b option c option d you can see and again there are clock also it is there is going from 45 minutes going below to zero and there are three menus are there what is the menu the center is complete you should not touch only at the end right is next and left is reverse this is the menu we have to use to go forward backward tell you follow the most important feature is not available in any online coaching center is 1 to 45 question number is there in yellow color please follow number 1 to 45 number will be there okay now you are seeing all these things so when when you click automatically the window will open automatically the clock will start starting from 45 uh, 44 59 uh, 58 uh, like that so you are reading uh, option a option c d etc and you observe let us assume you observed a is the correct answer do one thing you click a when you click a automatically the question number 1 in the below will from yellow color changing to green color the second question will be blue color all other will be in yellow color so what is the advantage is at any time you can see how many question attended how many question you have not attended along with the time you can see so you can adjust your time please follow self assessment you can do self uh, the, the what you can say uh, efficient you can uh, improve can you follow now suppose after 20 minutes you can see how many question you attended how many questions is still there so all attended question will be in green color all uh, uh, not attended question will be in yellow color except one is blue which is you are going to attend next please follow this is the idea so after finishing all the 45 question press complete when you press complete please follow your window will open this is another very very interesting what is happening in the window you will get marks you can see say for example you are getting 140 by 180 you are getting marks that means out so 40 marks you have loser you have lost 40 marks 40 means 10 questions you have lost so where you have done mistake you want to know so self assessment you want to do so there is a menu along this is a mark means next is the review so there is a review menu 
So click remove, no? immediately a window will open. So question one you can see, option A, option B, option C, option D, and below that the correct answer is given. Option, correct option D, that is, whatever option correct that is given in yellow color. And below that, there is video solution. Please follow. So this is entirely different, not available in uh, other online leading coaching center. So by this, you can improve your quality. Self-assessment you can do. What way? Just see, suppose you have clicked A, so A will be in blue color. Suppose if blue color and correct answer is same, your answer is right. The blue color and your answer is yellow, the correct answer is not coinciding, it, your answer is wrong. See, you can assess self-assessment, you can do. Where you have done mistake, you can assess. This facility is not available in other leading coaching center. Please follow. So the most important among them all, so suppose you are doing mistake, you want to know the answer. It's not necessary to go to book, to read a book or to go to library or go to your teacher to ask. Here we have a tutor. Video solution. Video solution. So professor who is handling the subjects, if you click the video, immediately he will explain. You can see him in front of your board along with your sketch pen and the board. Questions on the board, options are also on the board. He will read the question, he will read the uh, uh, options. You know, already experienced professor teaching with the PhD degree having uh, 20 to 30 years of experience. So he will explain each and every option logically and give a suitable definition, suitable formula, suitable diagram, everything he will write on the board and he explain. If it is a problem, he will work out the problem slowly with the, with the short route he will explain. How to multiply, how to uh, the divide, all the, the important tips he will give. So what is the information is, you are having each question, there is a one video solution. So that will run nearly 5 to 15 minutes, it will run, depending upon the nature of the question. Please follow. So this facility is not available in other online coaching. Please listen. So this is self-assessment. You can improve your quality. So for example, a student, even a dull student or a weak student, they can score up to 500 marks. If you are a very good student, a topper, so suppose first time you are getting 140 by, by 180, so after listening all the 45 questions of video, video solution, now you have knowledge, the, the possibility, the new information, new formula, new technique, everything you know now. So now you go for immediately test two. Again 45 questions, but different from the, the previous one. No question will be repeated. And again, these are all the 45 questions of previous question papers. So what you can happen to now? Attend again now. If now you will get nearly 170 to 180 out of 180. That means you are improving your quality by self-assessment. This facility is not available in other online coaching center. Please students, so better join in plus one itself so that it is useful to you. I can give you guarantee 100% you will get minimum 150 to 180 you will get marks. So this is again another interesting, this is a low cost. So I am giving for only collecting 10,000 rupees per year for all the four subjects. You can attend including 200 test unit test. Kindly take one test means one day if you click, uh, attend 200 days it is required. See, I have said a long time, it is necessary. So in the correction, everything will be done by automatically by the, uh, the software itself. Can you follow? So what will happen now? So this, how to pay this to join? To pay 10,000 rupees in the name of Santi, Director of IT Coaching Center. The Indian bank account number 7127194711, IFC code IDIB000P134, cell 989417642. Any queries or any, this is a WhatsApp number also. My dear students, 
Thank you very much for the kind cooperation. See you again in my next topic. Bye-bye.